All right, guys, let's talk a little bit about why the derivative of something like y equals 7 is 0. Why is that derivative 0? We can look at it physically. So here's the graph of y equals 7. We see it's a horizontal line, and therefore the slope is 0. Now remember, the derivative is just the slope. So if the slope is 0, by necessity, the derivative is also 0. So that's one way you can look at it. Here's another way to look at it. You should probably remember that any number raised to the 0 is 1. So x to the 0 equals 1. So if I start off with y to the 7, I could also write that as y equals 7 times x to the 0. Now, if you just kind of apply that derivative rule blindly, it'll end up actually working. So you have that 0 comes down. You multiply it by 7. 0 times anything is 0. You get y prime equals 0. So no matter how you look at it, the derivative of y equals any constant, any number, whether that's 7 or 437 or 9 million, the derivative of y equals any specific number is always going to be 0.